<laughs> Thank you, Vanna. <laughs> Hi, I'm Elaine, Teen Vogue's beauty and health director. It's my job to stay on top of all the latest trends and to know all the tricks in the book. This is three steps two. This is Philip Picardi, my rock star assistant PD editor. Hi guys. And today we're gonna tell you how to get rid of tired under eyes in just three steps. The first step is taking your makeup off. These are our favorite makeup removers of all time. We've officially tried everyone on the planet, I'd say. These are super, as they say in the title, simple. <laughs> Thank you, Vanna. <laughs> Make sure to be gentle with this part because you don't want to tug at your under eyes too much. Your under eyes are by far the most fragile skin on your entire body. Did you know your under eyes are one third thinner than the rest of your face? I think that's an amazing factoid. Step two is really a little trick that Philip brought to Team Vogue when he started. I have to admit we have pulled a couple of late nights together at the office and it always ends up in tired under eye bags the next day. Whether it's staying up late cramming for a test or you're staying out late partying, these Talica eye therapy patches are brilliant for reviving that skin under your eyes. So take us through step two. Totally, so as soon as you get these from the drugstore, you can actually really just pop these in your fridge. They come with this nifty little container. Basically it comes in a piece of strip on the back. You just have to peel that off and then you apply right to your freshly cleansed under eye. Looks a little crazy. <laughs> I think you look great. Thank you. <laughs> it's a nice product, but you could actually just use a cold compress, just get a washcloth, soak it in cold water, and just lay down for a little while and, and put it over your eyes and just rest it over your eyes before bed. It really helps with the swelling the next day. Totally, you can also do the same thing with um, cucumbers or you can um, put tea bags, especially green tea because it has a lot of caffeine. And you can just put those right in some cool water and then put them on your eyes. And it does kind of has the same effect. It's cooling, it promotes circulation on, on the under eye area. How long do we wait? 20 to 30 minutes. <laughs> Once you've left the eye patches on for about 20 minutes and you just peel them off like so. If you keep this little case that they come with, you can actually use these up to three times. Step three is to use a treatment concealer. I use Marc Jacobs' new concealer pen. It's called Remedy. And I use Benefit's Fake Up. I really like this one because it has a bit of color in the center and it has really great emollient moisturizers around the outside. So while you're getting the coverage, you also get a nice shot of moisture as well. You really should use your ring finger when you're applying any concealer under your eye. My mom taught me that tip when I was a little girl. She said Aww. anytime you're putting on moisturizer um, under your eye, the skin on your fingertip on your ring finger is actually uh, softer and it has, a, it has a softer cushion. Just like that, you have faked away. I think you look pretty good. Thank you. You too. What about me? <laughs> <laughs> to recap, step one is to remove all your makeup with a makeup towel. Step two is to use an eye treatment mask. And step three is to use a treatment concealer. So now that we faked awake, we have to get back to work, but be sure to tell us what else you want to see us do in the comments below. And be sure to subscribe to Teen Vogue's channel. Bye guys. Bye guys. See you next time.